Dear brothers and sisters in Christ Jesus, today, the 16th of January, Holy Mother, the Church calls us to the memory of Saint Joseph Vaz. Saint Joseph Vaz was ordained a priest in Old Goa in the year 1676 by March Bishop Monsignor Bardano. He was the Archbishop of Goa who ordained him as a priest the third son of Joseph and Christopher of Joseph Christopher and Maria Vaz. He went on, Joseph Vaz went on to become one of the greatest missionaries produced by Asia. He set off to Kanara, ended up in Sri Lanka, Ceylon, where at Kandy he proved his missionary acumen facing Bravely the vagaries of time, the weather, the hardships, and every king he met wanted to persecute him. Yet undergoing so many imprisonments and tortures, he stood as a strong witness to proclaim the rule of God. Long before inculturation, we know how he took up the the good things in the Indian culture and became a sannyasi, a sannyasi so that the people could accept him and accept the word that he was speaking. He picked up Sinhala and he was the person who wrote the first dictionary from English to Sinhala. An object lesson for missionary methods. This was his life because everything that he did was so beautiful and uh, such deep knowledge was there in everything he did. His dealings with people of every rank gave him the title as the perfect and model apostle. Joseph's pioneering efforts in organizing the first indigenous missionary institute in the third world known as the oratory of the cross of the miracles of old goa ensured the continuance of his work which saved the church in sri lanka from extinction his love for our lady is known to such extent that he wrote a letter of bondage to her after his ordination writing that in the presence of all angels and human beings and all creatures I, Father Joseph, was sell and offer myself as a perpetual slave of the Virgin Mother Mary. Dying as he lived, serene and calm, peaceful, a light was all around him. And the sweet name of Jesus on his lips. Joseph was beatified in the year 1995, Pope John Paul II, and canonized in the year 2015. He is known as a symbol of mission, as a symbol of fire to proclaim the word to the world. Amen.